Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Damria. Welcome back to Terra. Today, apparently, I logged in and I got something called Curious Catalyst. I have no idea what they are. We cannot trade them. No save value. This item must be, cannot be stored in the guild bank. So, alright, this is a superior, a superior outfitter's item. I'm guessing maybe it's a gem used for maybe transmog, possibly, or some kind of a like outfitter's feature. That's what I'm guessing. You must right click this item to register the catalyst in Kira's pop up uh, potion sh uh, shack. Be sure the Kira's pop up potion shack is active before you use this item. Alright, I already used one. I'm not sure if that's gonna do anything for us, but I'm just gonna kinda just let it be. Anyway, I might have messed up, but it's whatever. It's alright. Alright, anyway, for today, our main quests for today are. Let me see if I can pull them up. No, that's looking for group. That's friends. Quest log. There we go. So, my current quests right now are. Fairies in a fix, that's what I currently have to do. I have to, let me see, I think I have to slay some fairies. Take the Grace Bloom Essence to Lilyx at Fairwind Vale Camp. Pretty sure I did that. Let's start doing some of the mini quests over here. We got some several mini quests. Oh, there we go. Go to the area. We got a mini, we got a mini quest over here. Tame Poglings, we gotta go over here. Uh, Slinking Sabertooth and Fairy Insurgent. Let's go tame some of the piglings. I think we gotta use an item on them. Yeah, we gotta use a... Um, what is this thing called? It's a uh, pheromone dart. That's what we gotta use. A throwable pheromone dart. I'm gonna put it as F1 for now. Also, we got some mail apparently. Let me check on that. Terra login reward. Oh, we got more of this stuff. Not sure what it is for, but it's. We have it. We got it. Okay, we gotta go for, I believe, armored hawklings maybe? I think so. Let's go ahead and see if we can. Oh, but it's not kill him. Yes, come up to you. Use the pheromone. Pheromone dart used. He's still not a... Uh... Oh, friend. You gonna be a friend now? He's following us, so he doesn't seem to want to attack us. So let's just go ahead and cut him back, I guess. Is this gonna work? Oh, he still wants to fight us for some reason. Guessing that's not what we gotta do. I think we gotta get the runaway picks. Oh yeah, there we go. That's what we gotta use it on. Runaway picks. Come here, buddy. There we go. That's how we use it. Just tame pig. What do we do with you? Just have to interact. Ham over the lamp. Pull out, pull out the dart. Oh, now pull out the dart. It's gonna run up to us. Okay, good. It's moving after us. Sweet. Let's go move it back over here. Okay, so we use the dart on them until they're paralyzed. Then we take the dart out and they're gonna follow us here. Now, how many of them do we gotta bring back? Okay, we gotta bring uh, three of them back. Let's get uh, one of these guys over here. Come here, little guy. Can we use on both of them? I wonder if we can like tame two of them. We'll probably use on two of them. Yeah, I'm using you. Go take the dart out and take the dart out of you. Oh, apparently he doesn't have a dart in him. Maybe he does. Oh, now he does. They're gonna follow me. What are you doing here? Quit attacking my pigs. <laughs> Quit attacking my pigs. Hey, you. Quit attacking my pigs too. Oh, I end up killing a lot of pigs there. Oh, my bad. I'm gonna end up killing a lot of pigs. Hold on, team pigling. Can I do anything with this guy? I can't take out the uh, dart out of him. Whatever, I got one of them. I guess I just gotta cut him over here. Alright, little piglin, come over here. I guess I gotta do it one at a time or something. Come on, little guy. Come on, little buddy. Hurry up already. <laughs> I gotta team one more before I'm fully done with this thing. Okay, let's get the one that we tamed before. I think he should be still under our control. And if anybody else gets in front of us, we'll kill him with that big cannon. Nope, you better not. Yeah, yeah, that's how we do it. Get this little guy. Ham on the lamb. There we go. Pull out the dart. Hey, 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 hey. Quit, quit attacking my pig. That's my pig. Leave my pig alone. Hey, 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 hey. I. I how many times do I gotta tell you guys? Okay, quit it. Why do they. Why do they have. What is wrong? Why do they have a problem against my pig? Come on, this is my pig. It's under my protection. I have a giant cannon, and you do not want to mess with me. I have a giant freaking cannon. Apparently I have some kind of weird buff for that. Oh, there we go. I'm maxed out on abilities. Sweet. What does this do here? Let's see. Overcharge. Will power is not full. Will power can be stored up to 60 seconds. Okay, never mind. So, okay. So, that just says that we have overcharge right now on our weapon. Oh, let's talk to you. Mount over here. I'm just going to start skipping most of the dialogue unless it's very important. Because otherwise it's going to take me forever to do any of the questing in this game. And <laughs> I remember the first time I tried playing this game, I just spammed the F key to just be done with all the questing. So that's pretty much what I'm going to start doing now. Let's kill a couple fairies. These guys are so easy. I'm not even kidding you. It was a 
Either I was playing a wrong class or I didn't know how to play my class because before I played as a Slayer, I didn't play as a Gunner, right? And for me, Slayer was... it was okay, it wasn't too difficult, but it was alright, it was a challenge. But with this, it's like, this is nothing. Look how much damage I'm doing. I'm not even trying. I don't even have to try for anything. I'm doing so much damage against any of the enemies with one cannon shot. Either I'm way overpowered or this is just a really good class to play. Which I think it might be a, just a really good class to play. Oh my god. This guy's still not dead though. Yeah, yeah. Pick this up. Let's see, pick up the gold. Uh, what else I gotta do here? Let's see, I think I killed all the fairies, right? Yeah, I killed all the fairies. Now I gotta go get the Shaken Saber Tooth, or Saber Teeth. Let's go get them real quick. There he is. Oh, Slinking Saber Tooth? I'm not sure what they're called. What are you? You're Slinking Saber Tooth. Yep, that's you. Yeah, yeah. Gotta go from behind the enemy to get a nice crit. Over here. Nice! Hell yeah. Nope, oh, some lag. <laughs> yeah, nice. Ooh, look at this loot. I'll take all this. Let's see, so how many more we gotta kill here? We gotta kill. See, hunt the slinking saber tooth and collect their teeth. Okay, we gotta just collect the teeth. I'm just gonna go ahead and gather them together, see if I can AoE them. Oh hell, that's a lot of abs. Hoo-hoo. Okay then. Yeah yeah. Four, there we go. Ooh, nice. Look at the damage, it's ridiculous. I mean these guys take a little less damage, but still. That's some ridiculous damage for a gunner class. <laughs> Running around with a giant cannon now. Okay, just gotta get a couple more of these guys. I remember when I first played this game, getting the saber teeth was extremely difficult. I don't know what it was, maybe my friend and I just were sucking at the game so bad that we didn't know how to follow the rules and mechanics. But we had a hard time killing these guys. Not killing them, but collecting what we need to collect from them. It took us forever. Now they're just dropping like it's not even a problem, which is pretty interesting. Use the bomb on you. Yeah, yeah. Nice, all done. Sweet. Uh, do we gotta do anything else? No, I think we're pretty solid. Let's just come back to full run. Uh, what's the mount key again? There we go. There we go. Got our horse. Got our steed. Let's go ahead and ride back and report that we've killed everything that needs to be killed out here. There are plenty of ads here. I'm guessing this area is like... I don't know. In my opinion, I think this area is supposed to be designed to have a lot of players just run around and grind in this area. Because, I mean... I don't know. It's just a lot of ads to deal with. I don't know how everybody will be able to deal with so many ads. I don't know. Maybe just me. Maybe <laughs> you're just bad with, all, with dealing ads. Because look at that. It's impossible not to pull every single ad that you're running by. I don't know. Okay, go ahead and set the quest. And we got something over here. Hold on one sec, let me go through the quest line. What is this? Oh, hold on one sec. Hold on one sec, sir. There we go. So what are we talking to me about? Just checking in. So what do you press the HQ will bring up the Vanguard request window? What is this here? Okay, story, very selective service. But Kieran wants you uh wants your story quest. Roll call, attend one of the uh one last seven days, weekly bonus. Okay, this is part of the story right here. Uh, complete Devon Uprising quest. Check quest. Uh, that's what it is, Devon Uprising. Let's see, where on the map was it gonna be at? Previous step, next step, Devon. Where's Devon at? Da okay, Devon is back at, uh, what is this place? This is Lumbertown. Wait, we gotta come back. Oh, we do gotta come back all the way back. What is all this, Triton? I guess we've got more quests all over the place. Hello, I'm just gonna follow the main quest line, that's what I'm gonna do. If there's no reason for us to go out to different areas, then I'm just going to follow the main quest line. Simply because it's going to be easier for me to know where I'm going. Nothing new here, nothing new items. Alright, so we just got to go to Lumbertown. Back to Lumbertown. What about the rest of these quests? Slinking Sabertooth. Did I not do that? 
Slinking, Sabertooth, Slinking, Sabertooth. Did not, not do the Sabertooth quest. Slinking, Sabertooth, Slinking, Sabertooth. No, I already did it. Not in luck. Fairies are fixed. I don't have any fairies. Did I not bring the Grace Bloom flowers? Lilix. Where's Lilix at? Lilix is all the way there. Okay, gotcha. Well, I gotta come back to Lumbertown for the main quest. And let's see, what level am I, am I right now? Level 13. I could do the level 13 quests, right? Where's this gotta go? Not yet received this quest yet. Not yet unlocked. Valkyrian wants you. Acquire level 11. Receive from Helimir. Where they, where is Helimir over here? Honestly, I have no idea. I'm guessing we gotta find Helimir somewhere. Uh, add to quest tracker. Move quest tracker. I can just add a guess. I don't know. Let's do the fairies and the fix. That's what we're gonna do first. We'll start off with that. Take it nice and easy. We'll not rush it. Also, I got mail. What's in here? Crystals for you. Ooh, what is this? Red crystals can be equipped to weapons. Blue crystals can be equipped to armor. Red crystals provide various attacks related effects. Blue crystals provide various defense related effects. Or act like a crystal in your inventory to equip it. Ooh, let's accept all this. Let's play around with this a little. Hold on one sec. Let me dismount real quick. Okay, alright. So, let's go to inventory. What do we got here? We got some... Maybe destroyed upon death. Slot required one. Increase uh, damage to monsters. Increase damage to monsters. One is three point six percent. One four point seven percent. Can we use this? Oh, we can. What about armor? You can't attach a crystal to that item. So apparently, we can attach a crystal to a, one of our items. Hold on, let's see where's that. Is it P? Yeah, it's P for some reason. Okay, so these are the crystals that can go in here. Oh, I can put another weapon crystal. Nice. Okay, so this one is locked for now. I'll be able to add that later. These are the armor crystals. I can't seem to add these for some reason. Maybe they're not right level? Maybe I'm missing something? I think I'm missing something here. Maybe I need to like level up or something. Who knows? I'm just gonna stay with this for now. Hmm. So we got three crystals we can suck it in. Three damage crystals. Alright, so that's apparently how we upgrade gear. Let me go ahead and mount up. Let's right over to Lilix at... Uh, it doesn't say what it is. Fair one. Vile camp or fairy wild camp. Think. Let's see. Take, take the uh, Grace Bloom essence to Lilith at Feywine Vale camp. Okay, Feywine Vale. Let's go right over there. I'm gonna try to steal with one hand while I drink water with the other. <laughs> this might be a mistake, but I'm gonna give it a try. Hmm. We could probably. I'm. Here's the thing. I'm just guessing here, but. Maybe we don't even have to do the quest at Fey, uh, with uh, Lilix at Feywine Vale Camp. Maybe we can just skip that and continue on. These are red cap dwarves? What? <laughs> These are red cap dwarves. Hello. Hi. How's it going? <laughs> the dwarves. Alright then. <laughs> okay. The things you see in, ter in Terria. Uh, Terria Terra. This game does have some really good creature design though. Or just mob design in general. Let's go right over to the camp, but here's the thing. I don't know if I can just go on and just do level 14 stuff, or I gotta level up to level thir to level up 14, and then I can continue. I don't know that yet. So we're just gonna take a safe route, and just gonna go this way, see what this place is all about. And if it's any good, or if it's any decent, then we'll, I don't know, we'll try it. We'll try our hand at it. And defeat beasts, monsters, and sorcerers. For the Save the Forest quest. That's a level 12 quest. We don't really need it. There's Lilix over here. Lilix, hello. Bane fix. Is that it? There we go. Of all the creatures in our forest, the unicorn Saravi was the purest. Then the bad ones came. With their magic, their sinister power, they turn Saravi against us. If you can save Saravi, we can purify our forest. If you can't, then none of us will ever be safe. I guess none of us will ever be safe. Uh, I'm not sure if that's a necessity. Defeat Saravi the medium at the fairy pond. Let's do that. Uh, let's go do that right now. Let's see, where's Saravi at? Saravi, 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 Saravi. There we go. Saravi is number one over there. Alright, let's go around the left side of the fairy pond, and let's take down Saravi. Apparently enemies can take over somehow? They can take over powerful creatures such as a unicorn? I guess? I don't know. <laughs> let's 
This world is pretty new to me, so I'm still learning the mechanics of it all and just the mysteries of it all. Although this is a gorgeous world, a brand new world, but a gorgeous looking world. I mean, look at the look at the tree line and everything. This looks really pretty. I like it. I like it a lot. No wonder this game gets a lot of popularity. Are we going to the right place? No, we're not. <laughs> I need to follow the little minimap over here on the side in order to know exactly where I'm going. Because this minimap is not going to tell me anything. Can we just take this minimap away and just replace them? And just put them in a little circle? I don't know. It will, it, will, it will make sense, but I guess I guess not for me then. <laughs> I guess... Whatever. Uh, Saravi, there, there he is. Let's go ahead and dismount. Alright, so best way to take him on, I guess, to attack him. See if he can not attract any more ads. Just take him on by himself. Stay far away from him. Get some damage from afar. He's not charging yet, so let's just keep grinding at him. And done. Wow, this was very, very easy, actually. Surprisingly easy. And also, we gotta get Fae Forests. And it's Ravi. There he is. Uh, we could probably kill some of the Fae Forest ads. Yeah, let's go do that. What's going on? Lag spike? Hello, game? Oh, yep, lag spike. <laughs> That's some serious lag spike. Wow. Wow, what's going on here? Hello. And Sarabi's attacking another Sarabi. Wait, another Sarabi spawned? Whoa, okay then. Oh, where are you going? There we go. That's some serious lag spike going on here. Hello. <laughs> what is this? This is crazy. I mean, I'm still able to do some kind of damage, but still. Oof. There's Sorabi over here. Let's talk to Sorabi before more lag spike happen. Fears in the fix. It's not even letting me grab the quest properly. You know, I'm just gonna use my mouse cursor to do this. I'm just gonna, you know, nice and easy. Nice and easy with this. And he disappears. Alright then. See you later, Sorabi. We also got another Sorabi over here. How many more Sorabis can we find around here? Let's go and jump in the water to fight it. Can we jump in the water? No, we can't. Okay, we can't we can't fight in the water, that sucks. Can we jump? No, we can't let me jump. Can use any abilities whatsoever. <laughs> well, that's kind of lame, actually. All right, now we can get out and land and fight him. Now we can fight him properly. And yeah, it still lags. Wow, this is what is going on here. I'm hoping it's not something on my end because I'm not. I shouldn't be downloading anything unless I am some. Unless I am downloading something in the background, I just don't know about it yet. And that's a freaking mystery to me. It's lagging up our ability to shoot with a machine gun for some reason. <laughs> this is really dumb. I'm not liking this. Can this be be fixed? Uh, whatever company that is working on this game. I actually have no idea what the company for this game is. Please fix this. <laughs> for love of God. I want to be able to play my character. Be able to fire properly. Without all this insane lag. <laughs> That's kind of the problem with games that we like require you to have really good connection. Is that... There's an issue whenever there's like insane lag because that will affect the gameplay completely and sometimes bullets will take a while to, you know, fly over there and fly and hit the enemy and everything like that and we get lag where we can't even do anything <laughs> or everything is just terribly delayed. It's better now. We're able to defeat... God, the Gatling Gun effect is incredible. I love it. Okay, now that that's what I'm talking about with lag. <laughs> <laughs> that point that just makes it a little bit impossible to fully fully enjoy and play our character there. Oh my god, I can't even do anything. <laughs> what is this? Might be this area actually. I might want to just get away from here. Maybe this area is like causing a lot of lag spikes. Okay, well you know what? We'll find more creatures in later time. Let's go ahead and uh we gotta use I think we had a scroll for yeah, teleport scroll, there we go. Uh move to Lumber Town? Yeah, let's go do that. Oh, man, my eyes are even hurting a little bit from, from the lags make my eyes hurt just a little bit just a tiny bit oh. All right, well, let's go ahead and see if hopefully we can avoid the lag either something's happening with the servers or something is happening with my Steam or something. Let me check just just in case make sure nothing is updating because it is a Monday recording us on a Monday Oh wait something was updating never mind then there was a patch for a game <laughs> By the way, thank you for whoever gave me that game. Yeah, I really appreciate it I haven't yet to try but I'm looking forward to trying it for sure 
Anyway, let's go and talk to the person in Lumbertown. We have to talk to uh, Perfect Daven in Lumbertown to continue our main quest. I'm just not gonna say any more animals. I'm just gonna continue on further down. Okay, there's something happening. Oh, wait, that's what is going on. One channel one. That's why. Hold on one sec. Let me, switch, let me change to a less less popular channel so it doesn't have to load everybody. This game always had some kind of problem with loading in general. And I mean, even I even upgraded my upload speed and everything. My internet is upgraded, so I should have no problem loading and, you know, uploading and downloading data. Maybe something wrong with the servers. Maybe I'm connected to a faraway server, which is why I'm having lag issues. But when it comes to like action MMOs, that is the biggest problem for most of them is lag can cause some serious damage to or just in general it can cause some serious performance to your playstyle and how you play the game, whether the effects don't load or your gun does for some reason doesn't shoot. See that took forever. Okay, now it's a little better. Takes a while before my my clicks are even rendering whatsoever, but I guess that's the best thing we can go with. Oh, there's also a pumpkin head over here. Can we do anything with the pumpkin head? Press to interact. No, we can't even do anything with it. Can we shoot it? That does nothing. <laughs> Never mind. Let's talk to Daven. Okay, that's a little better. We can work with that. Find Latin east of Lumbertown Pegasus platform. Uh, that is over there. So let's go ahead and mount up. Press the H key. Click in the H key. Uh, checkpoint. Uh, Devon Uprising wants you to return to the story quest checkpoint. No, check quest. Okay, that's where we gotta go. Let's just go follow the main quest. We don't need to go to checkpoint. Although, being at a checkpoint is kind of cool. Having a checkpoint for a quest is kind of neat. I think that's the first game I know, the first MMO I know that sets up checkpoints. Hello there, how's it going? Oh, this is the crystal merchant. Oh, I wonder what we can do with the crystal merchant here. Let's talk to a crystal merchant. An Let's see what they got for us. You. Buy crystals. Oh, we can buy these kind of crystals and armor crystals. Nice. What about this person over here? The alchemy Federation and materials. And nah, that's not what we need. Never mind. Was this here before? I'm pretty sure this wasn't. I think this is a new building just where the Halloween event. I think that's what's going on. That's what explains the pumpkins and all that. Anywho, let's continue on out of the city and over to, let's see, the Pegasus platform. Lumbertown Pegasus platform. There we go. There he is. Latorn or Latin? No such thing as a free lunch. 